Hey, it's Jabbo. In this video, we're going to be looking at uh, the vintage lot and random crazy pieces that we got from the Goodwill auction. Uh, previously, they just uh, keep you up to speed. It's the one where we had the Charles chips uh, with the rare vintage pieces. Well, maybe not rare, but vintage pieces. And we're going to be looking at some other stuff. So these are some of the pieces uh, that came in that lot. So we got random Technic pieces. I feel like I should be sorting this as I'm doing it. We got some random bricks. And that is not Lego. Now that is, oh, you know what? I think that whole bag, dang it, I shouldn't have dumped that out because all of those pieces are not Lego. In fact, they're not even Mega Blocks. I don't know what they are. Oh, I probably should be doing this a different way. Well, we're just going to dump all this other stuff out. Wow, it is a big garbage bag. I mean, it's literally a garbage bag. A literal garbage bag. <sighs> all right, when you realize that you've been talking forever and ha haven't been recording. All right. <laughs> all right, so... I found this. This is a Mega Block set, I believe, for or something Spider-Man related. I don't know for sure if it's Mega Blocks. I think it's Spider-Man related. This has random non-Lego and Lego pieces mixed together in there. This is definitely not Lego, so that's going in the garbage. I don't know what this thing is. Um, I mean, I know it's not Lego, but I'm trying to decide. No, I'm gonna throw it away. These are interesting. They almost look like they're upside down. I guess they go like that. What else we got here? Okay, that's not Lego. Don't get all the definite non-Lego stuff out of here. What is that? Not Lego. Yeah. That's like quite a bit of Lego. I thought there was actually going to be more non-Lego. Than there, what there is, but it's quite a good variety of Lego pieces. There's an astronaut. Oh, brick separator! A minifigure head. Let's see if there's anything special. That's not special. Another brick separator. A card for game right. Garbage. That's garbage. A crayon. Here, that goes to that other thing we saw that was clear. Just looking for, oh look, a brick fever tile. Wow, there's quite a bit of actual genuine Lego pieces in here. That is pretty amazing. There's far less non-Lego stuff than I thought. I may keep that for the Hot Wheels stuff. That looks like junk. Probably worth a million dollars. I don't know. That's junk. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a dinosaur. You're getting all the... What on earth is that? That probably goes with that other clear thing. I don't know. That's a... Ooh, that's actually a pretty cool Lego windshield piece there. Not many minifigures in here. It's like whoever had it picked through and got all the rest of the minifigures out. There's a micro figure. All right, so, well, there's a droid body. Not bad. Well, this definitely needs to be washed. I'm going to need to go wash my hands after handling this. Um, I'm going to throw away all of that non-Lego stuff. So I dumped all that back in the box, uh, the regular box that it came in. I'm now the one that I'm most interested in. And to be honest, uh, what I just showed you uh, was well worth what I paid for the lot. Um, a good, I don't know how much it weighed, but that was a, very, a lot more Lego pieces than I expected from looking at the pieces. Now, the main thing I wanted in this auction was the Charles Chip. In fact, let me get the thumbnail picture for the Charles Chips. What's in the Charles Chips? Charles shit. I closed the lid. I closed it. I closed it to take the thumbnail. All right. All right, here we go. I'm dump this thing out. All right. What do we got? 
this sticker sheet is interesting. I'm going to set that to the side. I don't know if that went to one of the idea books or if it went to an actual set. Oh, nice. Classic space. Classic space. So, worn out classic space guy. Vintage, I think it was a firefighter or so. There's this. Oh, you know what? I think this was, this was probably, I wonder if that was one of the stickers on there. Firefighter. Too bad if it's messed up. There's that other number one sticker. There's a worn out spaceman. Look at that. Wow. Is that 487 parts? I don't know. There's another one of those. Another firefighter. So it's a little bit of fire and a little bit of classic space. Very nice. There's another one of those. Some nice classic space pieces. Oh, that's a definitely from classic space set. Oh, what was that set? Oh, brick trains will know. It's a set that had all these. And this, that may be what these are all actually from. That's it. Oh, that's a nice piece there. There's another space guy. Very nice. So, let me know in the comments below if you know which classic space set these parts likely came from. There may be multiple sets with that. With these wheels and this, I'm pretty sure it came from a particular set, which I can't remember off the top of my head. But this is a very nice uh, assortment. There's one of the stickers that came off there. The vintage pieces. I should see if I could piece together uh, a set or how much of a set. So obviously we got a fire set and a classic set, a set at least, or sets, I should say. Nice windshields, nice windshields. Yeah. Pretty neat. I just wanted to show you what was in this lot. So tell me what you think. How did I do with my Charles chip can for $8? This is basically, uh, I did not have these sets as a kid, but this would have been what my collection uh, kind of would have looked like with a collection of some town sets and very few space sets uh, all stored in a charles chip can <laughs> so let me know if you know what if you can i mean i could go right now and look this sticker up and see which set it came from obviously i'm pretty sure it's a fire set could be wrong and this space is a sp classic space set with these wheels so let me know in the comments below if you can guess again it could be multiple space sets i was thinking 487 but i may be wrong but with this one and these it's another set and i think these blue pieces went with that too i'll be looking up the inventory for that set and seeing if i can how much of it i can piece together because i don't think i have that set so might have a lot of the parts from it now so that's the good thing about uh, finding a nice lot on ebay i mean uh, or ebay too but this was goodwill and uh, again, I got it for the Charles Chips can. <laughs> and I got all this and then all that other that I showed you. So nice little uh, collection of used Lego bricks for my collection. Ooh, I thought those were rare two by four red bricks. Very rare. So now we're gonna do a Pablo that's picking a Bricklink Lego order from my Bricklink store. And this is for Lazy Zamboni. What a name. Pretty cool, huh? And I'm going to find that there's a part here that I didn't remember putting in the store. I don't know how long it's been there. It's a used part. It's in drawer three. And it's a vintage part. Why am I selling this? I don't know. It's a pneumatic valve piece here in old gray. Oh, man. Why did I sell this? Well, Lazy Zamboni is getting it. And this is one of my favorite kind of orders because he's getting everything. So I'm going to go ahead and get the drawers. He got all the 1x12 black plates. He got 
1214, which is all these Technic axles, one by seven. There. We got drawer 1671, which is all of these, a little bit longer axles there. Next up is drawer 2002. You got all of these little thin uh, lift arms. Should be seven in there. Yes, there's seven. All right, next is drawer 2055. Oh, I'm loving this order. You got all of these bricks. One by what, 12 there? Yes, eight one by 12 bricks. We got drawer 2764. It's way back over here. 2764 is all three of these longer lift arms. It's getting all the lift arms. What is the lazy Zamboni building? These are all black pieces. Um, hmm. 3507 is right behind me here somewhere. More lift arms, the one by five lift arms. Wow. He's building a roller coaster. I don't know what he's building. 3788. Lazy Zamboni can comment on here what he's building. You can guess. He's got these angled lift arms. I need to slide over some here. Uh, we got drawer 4223. 4223. Here we go. We got two of these. Alright, that's right. We got drawer 4409, one of the last drawers. Got those lift arms. And we got box Z76. Z76, where is it? Where is it? Still here. Get all these. And one more vintage piece. This is where sometimes I forget I have stuff in my store. <laughs> he got a vintage black motor. This is a four and a half volt. There's no way I would have sold a 12 volt motor. I ha actually have a ton of these. That may be why I had it in the store, but this is a vintage. Um, like a motor. So that is the order. I just gotta, all I gotta do is double check and count everything. Oh, and he gets a one by, I mean, one, 141 break number, um, 141 brick czar signed two by four red brick, which is gonna look weird in this order. But anyway, thank you, Lazy Zamboni, for the order.